there is also another possible scenario if we want to monitor in the nested virtualization environment because HyperDG is the first driver in the stack layer. It receives the VM call and we could decide whether we want to pass it to the top level hypervisor or we could we want to modify it. We, we could make them uh, make change on them by using the uh, VM call command. This is actually uh, an, an event that is exported in HyperDVG. So a, every execution of uh, a VM call instruction in the target, target virtual machine uh, will uh, trigger uh, HyperDVG's VM call command. And it's also up to you, up to you to whether to pass it to the top level hypervisor or ignore it. Uh, for example, uh, if you want to monitor some of the hyper calls in Hyper-V, you could use this command and uh, you can also suppress uh, the request. So here is an example. For example, this VM call uh, is executed and uh, we show the parameters here.